welcome students to physical fitness components. But first, let us try to decode what is physical fitness. Physical fitness is the ability to do everyday tasks without becoming short of breath, sore, or tired. Physical fitness is a general state of health and well-being and more specifically, the ability to perform aspects of sports, occupations, and daily activities. Physical fitness is generally achieved through proper nutrition, moderate to vigorous physical exercise, physical activity, and enough rest. More on physical fitness, according to the World Health Organization or WHO, physical inactivity can have serious implications for people's health. Approximately 2 million deaths per year are attributed to physical inactivity, prompting WHO to issue a warning that a sedentary lifestyle could be very well among the 10 leading causes of death and disability in the world. World Health Day is celebrated annually on April 7 and used to inform the public about leading public health issues. By choosing or by choosing physical activity as the theme for World Health Day, WHO is promoting healthy, active, and tobacco-free lifestyles. The aim is to prevent the disease and disability caused by unhealthy and sedentary living. Next, more on physical fitness. Physical educators play a major role in reducing physical inactivity worldwide. They give appropriate fitness exercises and assesses every student in reaching out their desired fitness goals. In this pandemic, almost 80% of the people are limited in their physical activities. Fitness instructors and other physical activity enthusiasts have major innovations to promote physical activity at home. Health-related fitness components. This involves exercise activities that you do in order to try to improve your physical health and stay healthy. There are five components of health-related fitness. First, cardiovascular endurance. It is the ability of your heart and lungs to work efficiently during physical activity. If you have good respiratory endurance or cardiorespiratory endurance, you can probably exercise for several minutes before you notice your faster breathing. Aerobic activity improves cardiorespiratory endurance. During aerobic activity, your body uses oxygen to get energy. Activities that can improve cardiovascular endurance are running, walking, and cycling. Muscular strength. It is the amount of force muscles apply when they are used. It can be measured by the amount of weight you can lift. Strong muscles support bones and joints. It can keep you from getting hurt. Activities that can improve muscular strength are weightlifting, compound exercises like multi-joint examples uh, are squats, and more weights and less reps. Muscular endurance. It is the ability to use a group of muscles over and over without getting tired easily. Muscular strength and muscular endurance are related. Muscular strength helps you lift something heavy and muscular endurance helps you lift it repeatedly. Another hint for muscular endurance is how long will your muscles endure the lifting of an object. Activities that can improve muscular endurance are bicep curls, push-ups, and squats, also lunges. Flexibility. It is the ability to use joints easily. It is how flexible a joint is. It also depends on three types of soft tissue, muscles, tendons, and ligaments. Muscle is the most elastic tissue of all three. It has the greatest effect on flexibility. Flexible joints are less likely to get injured. Regular physical activity is usually enough to stay flexible. Even if you are not very physically active or physically active, you should at least stretch every day. Body mass index. 
It compares the weight of fat in your body to the weight of bones, muscles, and organs. These changes throughout your entire life. Females usually have a higher percentage of body fat than men do. Poor body composition can make moving some joints difficult. It also makes the heart and lungs work harder during physical activity. Formula for body mass index is equal to weight divided by height squared. And this will be your weight class. Skill-related fitness components. The ability to perform during games and sports, also called performance fitness. Skill-related fitness has six components. Agility. The ability to change and control the direction and position of your body while maintaining a constant, rapid motion. Sample test for this particular skill is hexagon test. Balance. The ability to control or stabilize your equilibrium while moving staying still. Sample test for this skill, historic balance test. Coordination. Speed, reaction time, and agility may influence level of coordination. The ability to use your eyes and ears to determine and direct the smooth movement of your body. Sample test for coordination is paper juggling. Speed. The ability to move your body parts or parts of your body quickly. Sample test for speed is 40 meter sprint. Power. The ability to move your body parts quickly while at the same time applying the maximum force of your muscles. Sample test for power is basketball pass. Reaction time. The ability to react or respond quickly to what you hear, see, or feel. Sample test for reaction time is stick drop test. Thank you so much for listening and watching Physical Fitness Components. I hope you learned something from this video and please do not forget to like and subscribe our YouTube channel, Mape Nominals. Thank you and God bless.